Hey everybody, we are back, and we're going down deeper into the castle, which is great, since we just came up from the freaking sewers. Yeah, I'm just going to kind of rush through here, because I know that there's no monsters, and you came to see a blind play, and me knowing what's going to happen, that's no good. So I want to hurry up and get to where I don't know what's going to happen. I need you to stay awake. Can you feel the syringe? No. I can't feel anything. Alexander? Yes. Soon, I won't even be able to move, will I? Your life is safe. I don't doubt that. But will it be worth living? And now, everybody? Meet Agrippa. We are Daniel. Daniel? Like the prophet thrown into the lion's den? Unfortunately. Tell me, are you among the lion's den? Yeah. You want to stop Alexander? Yeah. Oh my. So Babylon shall fall, you say. Unfortunately. <laughs> you are a privilege. Alexander is toothless without an orb. He has an orb. Alright, so we're gonna go find ourselves uh, some of those. Would you consider taking me this you? Sure. I know it sounds ridiculous. Not really. But if you find anything concerning a man named Johan Heimer, would you please bring it to me? Sure. I believe he was working on a way to help him. A recipe for some sort of potion, a tonic to reach Princess Huskama. Sure, we'll help you out. Why not? Fix it. So many of Alexander's things are breaking down. Look around. Maybe some other will open. There are machine parts hidden all over this place. You'll find a way to fix it. Well, I think I just fixed it, so. Actually, I didn't do that before. And Heinrich Cornelius Agrippa. At this yep. point, quite important to you. Baron Alexander has sustained my soul in this dead heart for years. Who knows how many? Hundreds, I presume. All right, we're going to go. Those two doors are both locked. I'm going to go ahead and add that to my memento. Oh, it's not. Never mind. So, uh, head through here. Nothing in here. Yeah. Ah, excuse me. I'm just making sure I don't miss nothing. Actually, I'm going to save my oil. So I'm really paranoid about losing my oil now. <gasps> we got a chicken leg! I'm 
know this. I've been here already. I know this taste. The taste of the Mascus Rose obfuscating the truth in the very game. They may sweep the traces from my memory, but my body remembers. These cuts volumes, even though my mind remains silent. They will be back. Uh, they will be back. That part always makes me wonder, well not always, but that whenever I first saw it, made me wonder because, well, it sounded kind of like Daniel. And, oh, oh crap, we're having a mental breakdown. Anyway, and it sounds like Daniel, and he was talking about the Damascus Road, oh, hey, look at that, that's... Had gone too far, the man was suffocating as he could no longer breathe properly between the lashes. Displeased, he started to look for the Damascus Rose Oil. I was just talking about that. Now, here is where I am. See, I wasn't too far ahead. This is where I... I called it... I called it quits. It's close now. There's a monster in there. I don't know where exactly it is. There it is. I have a feeling we're about to die. Oh God. Piss, 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 piss. Don't look at me. Sprint, Daniel! Oh, no, not, no, no time for freaking. It's like Orpheus descending into the underworld. Are you run, something? run, run. What do you mean? Never mind. Your intuition is what? remarkable. Um. I'm not sure I'm falling. It doesn't matter. Okay. It's just a myth after all. Is this the inner sanctum? What in the world? Well, whatever happened to that thing, it vanished. Lucky us. This must be the sanctum. Oh, there's a smooth hemispheric dispersion on top. Ah, that's where. That's where we're gonna need our stuff. So. Apparent thing, apparently, that thing left. That was odd. That was really odd. It vanished. Alright. Well, whatever. Oh. The shattered orb. All is lost. I must once again start over. Ever since I recovered the orb, first found from... Founded... First found by Agrippa. I have depended on it for my research. The incident with Wilhelm, Wilhelm made me most impetuous. Fearing a pos paucity, paucity of prisoners, I proceeded to with the final ritual without proper foresight. The orb cracked and fell into six parts. I have tried everything, but I have yet to mend the thing. Unless I can think of a way to piece it together, I will have to find another. There is still life in the pieces even pieces and even if the orb isn't restored 
I might be able to salvage some of its power for some other purposes. Centuries have passed in vain, and I begin to wonder if I will ever be able to see my love again. How much longer can I sustain my life? Cool armor. Look at all these, like, fancy things. Look at this thing and that thing. That is so cool. Treasure mine. What do we got here? Like a sacrifice table? Well, it looks like, oh, over a pit of death. All right. Apparently nothing there. So let's head this way. Um. Oh crap, we've reached the darkness. Oh, gears, gears. Oh, paper. 12th of August, 1839. Banishment ritual is taking longer than expected, and we have to do what is needed. I spend my time helping out the prisoners. Being around these degenerates makes me ill. None of them even tries to face their punishment with any kind of dignity. They taunt me with their lies of innocence and their cowardly pleas of mercy. What can make a man fall so far from the grace of a civilized existence? They are all wicked men, and I remind myself of it constantly. Still, I am thankful for God sending these monsters our way, as they will serve as the instruments of my salvation. I try to study the different tools in the torture chamber and learn how to use them effectively. Last time was messy, and the effect suffered from my inexperience. When the next warding is to be performed, I shall be ready. Yeah, Daniel, unfortunately, no. Those are not... Those are those are probably innocent men. Bucket of tar. What would tar be used for? A budge. Okay. Um Alright then. I don't know what we would use tar for. Let's go back up to that one room. That, uh, one of the levers. So move that gear, which I didn't do before. Is this new time, missing ten? If so, blame yourself. You started this. You sent me that letter asking for help, and this is how you repay me? How dare you! Alright, we're running low on time, so uh, next time on Let's Play Amnesia, we go see if we can open up those doors. I'll see you next time, guys.